Well, Sam, congratulations on signing your new contract. Just tell us how delighted you are to get that done now. Yeah, I'm delighted to get the deal over the line and obviously sign a new contract for this club. And it um, feels great, really. And you've really pushed on, especially in the last couple of weeks since you've been given your chance by head coach Brian Dutton. You know, how pleased are you with how you've progressed recently? Yeah, I mean, I'm doing well. I'm starting games back to back, and obviously, I can't thank the gaffer enough for putting his trust into me, and obviously, to keep putting his trust into me. And for, for when he does pick, put me in the starting lineup, I have to give my all, and I always will give my all, and I'll give my all for every game that I play this for the rest of this season and next season as well. And as a young player, you know, do you feel yourself now progressing week on week? The more minutes you get, yeah, definitely. I mean, the more games you play the fitter you become the, the stronger you become and you have do you know what I mean a lot more energy doing towards the end of the game and hopefully obviously the more games I play the, the fitter and better I'll become on the pitch and you've seen just what it's like for other academy graduates in the club you know Alfie's gone on to make 50 other appearances Liam Kinsella's made you know well over 100 closing in on, on 200 I believe now you know it must give you a lot of confidence to know that this club you know, is really proud of their academy graduates. Oh yeah, definitely. That's the, that's the thing, isn't it? The the two, obviously Alfie and Kins, both came through the academy and both made so many appearances. And hopefully, I can do the same. And for yourself, what's it been like working under Brian Dutton as a head coach? You now you've worked under him as a coach before, but now you've you've really started to progress under him. Yeah, he's helped me a lot from the time that he became the gaffer and before he became the gaffer and hopefully I'll keep learning uh, with him as the gaffer and I'll keep pushing on and hopefully get many more appearances. And you mentioned appearances there, what are your aspirations moving forward now, you know, what are you looking to get out of the rest of this season and moving into next season? Well, to be fair, I've got to take it game by game and take it as it comes really. I mean, uh, hopefully get more goals, that's the target, and more assists. But it's about the three points and obviously we picked up three on Saturday and it was it was a great feeling. And that, that's it, isn't it? It's picking up those points, it's picking up the draws, the wins. The wins, obviously, the more important ones. And you tasted that for the first time really on uh, Saturday in the league against Forest Green. What was it like to be in that dressing room after a win, having not had one for, for a couple of months? Yeah, it's a great feeling to have, and it? Uh, walking in after three points, I mean, it's been a long time coming and we could have picked up a few along the way, but obviously due to referee decisions and things like that, but we can't put that, uh, take that as thingy, so it was a brilliant feeling really, and hopefully we'll pick up three more tomorrow night. And it's all about that now. You, a lot of people mention playing academy football, development football, and not being much on the line there. But have you really noticed the step up into first team football? Oh yeah, definitely. Um, at academy level, you you don't really play for points. Do you know what I mean? And then obviously coming into professional football, you're playing for points, and that's the main thing about getting the wins on the board. And hopefully we can pick up many more now. Oh!